This is the installation guide for the Santoft medium format dry verge system. Suitable for use with 2020 and Balmoral tiles. Install your underlay in the normal way, ensuring a 40mm overhang at the verge. Fix your battens to an even tile gauge up the length of the rafter, making sure that you extend the battens past the end of the verge by 36mm. This is the eaves closure for the medium format dry verge system. Fit your tile into position first of all, ensuring the correct overlap at the verge and at the eave. Simply position the eaves closure unit using the tile locator to the end of the tile and there are multiple fixing points for the eave closure. These are the two components for the medium format dry verge system. This is the batten bracket, this is the unit. We're going to do a left hand verge, simply fit the batten bracket into the left hand slot and this peg for the eave system needs to line up with the eaves closure that you can see there and that will hold the unit secure at the eave. Locate the peg into the eaves closure and simply push into place and then the batten bracket can be adjusted to suit and to meet with the top edge of the batten. This can now then be secured and fixed into place. The batten brackets can either be nailed or screwed but two fixings are required. Once the first verge unit is in position, the easiest way to fit the verge units is to slide the batten bracket into the slot. The peg locates into the keyhole slot there, like so. The unit adjusts up and down along the length of the keyhole. Simply fix the batten bracket into place and then place the tile into position. and secure it according to the fixing spec and then simply slide the verge unit to the tail of the tile. Continue fitting the verge units until you reach the apex and there we have the installed medium format dry verge system.